moving house and starting a new job are renowned as some of the most stressful things you can do in life. My partner and I, well, we were doing both. It's safe to say I hadn't much time for fishing, but soon I was able to explore my new surroundings and my first focus was exploring the canals. Canals were built at the height of the Industrial Revolution through genius engineering, skilled workmanship and hard work. Today they are recognised for their ecology and heritage, offering a multitude of health and wellbeing benefits for communities across the UK. This does of course include fishing. It was just me and my dog Tan counting the locks, watching the boats go by, and keeping a keen eye on the progress of the local ducklings. Rather unexpectedly, we got involved with assisting a local beekeeper in rescuing a bee swarm from a rotting tree trunk, as well as meeting our new friend James, who we now regularly go fishing with. remember the chub that I was catching from canals in Yorkshire using the swing tip method. This included a personal best at over five pounds. I used the same tactics on two new canals that I never fished before. This included short sessions on the Leeds Liverpool Canal and the Shropshire Union Canal. Despite my best efforts, the only catch on the Leeds Liverpool Canal was an eel. Aye. It's great fun, isn't it, fishing time? <laughs> you having a good time? Where's it gone? Hey, good girl. <laughs> At least the dogs are having a good time. So it was back to the drawing board and on to the next canal. Just working away and it just so happens that halfway between my house and where the training course is. There's some really good fishing on the Shropshire Union Canal. Have a guess what I'm up to. So I kicked off with a full king prawn. So all I've been doing is putting a very small piece of chopped prawn, so I was getting nothing on the big, uh, on the full prawn, and wrapping it around the back of the shank on a much smaller hook. This is a size 10, and just putting a bit of this additive, which smells horrific. This monster crab. And very quickly after the first cast, the bites came in quick succession. So 
But there we are, boys. First fish from the Shropshire Canal. A lovely bream. Lovely job on the old swing tip. Happy days. Key distinguishing features of the silver bream are the eye being closer to the top of the skull and closer to the snout when compared to common bream, as well as having dusty pink, pelvic and pectoral fins. In you go, son. Bream. Lovely, lovely fish. Common bream also have bigger mouths and are much duller in colour when compared to silver bream. Really good nick this one. After running out of time, I was still pretty damn chuffed with catching the common bream and the rarer silver bream. Thanks for watching.